Hello everybody, it is me, Mr. Pokemon, and today I have a very special announcement. I know you've been waiting a week for this big announcement, and before you ask, no, it is not a sequel to the beloved Pokemon Smile, and it is not a new remake. We're doing something very original. Please, take a look. Bright enough for you? Oh shoot, uh, that's not the gameplay. Sorry, our production is pretty bad. Here's the real gameplay. So, what do you think? As of recent years, Pokemon's been trying to break the mold of what a Pokemon game could be. They've made a lot more spin-offs than they're used to. Most notably, Pokemon Tournament. Uh... Pokemon Tournament. What seems as Pokemon's new philosophy is to bring Pokemon into the mainstream. But how do you bring a video game in the mainstream? Just make it an eSport. It's just that easy. And who knows eSports better than Tencent Games? If you don't know what Tencent Games is, they're essentially the eSports kings, but not in the way you think. You see, they don't make games. They own games. Let me show you. They own 100% of Riot Games and League of Legends. They own 40% of Epic Games. They own 12% of PUBG. They own 5% of Ubisoft. They own 5% of Activision Blizzard. They own 80% of Path of Exile. Other ones, they own a bit of Platinum Games. They own a bit of Discord, Funcom. They own my d they own everything under the sun. And do you really think we're going to trust a company that has an always-on anti-cheat system that could potentially dox you? All right, enough of the game behind the scenes. Let's talk about the actual game. It's dumb. Pokemon Unite just doesn't feel and look like an actual Pokemon game. This game looks half-baked. Pokemon Unite makes... Pokemon type wild look like the Mona Lisa. They're trying to bring their own unique flavor to a MOBA game, but I just can't shake my head around the fact that this game looks identical to League of Legends, but they just moved the map 45 degrees. And speaking of the map, what the heck is this? They look near identical. If Nintendo really wanted to make another splash in esports, like Smash Brothers does, then they should do something original. Not just rip off of every MOBA game, especially the biggest one that I don't know, the company that's helping you make it owns 100% of it. If you really wanted to make a big splash in esports, make something original. It doesn't have to be a MOBA. It doesn't have to be a fighting game. It can just be what you want. If they wanted to make a MOBA game, they should have built it from the ground up. Just slapping some Pokemon on there isn't gonna get you bank. It's not. What also concerns me is that they said this game is going to be free to start. Oh lord. This game looks like it's been in development for a month. This game looks like it could be made for iPhone 4s. This game looks like it can run on Google Slide. On top of that, Nintendo Online is complete trash. So if you're going to have a high skill quote unquote MOBA game, you're going to have to have a good internet provider better than my grandparents. I thought Nintendo was done with their shady business practices to bow down to the Chinese entertainment industry. Congratulations, Nintendo. 